Hey everybody, welcome back to the shop. Ten more minutes, Thunder Chief building action. Brought to you in prime time. Drama free. Broadcasted in Philo Vision. Check that out. There you go, Luke. I got it all cut out for you. You know, canopies are marked. It's pretty easy. Use the old vibrating saw. I'm going to show you something. By uh, laying that up the way I did it, you know, it uh, two layers on the bottom. It's got two layers of 10 ounce and I, you know, curved it up. And look at that. That is just firm, solid. Don't weigh very much. You know, that is nice, nice. Can you see where I squirted that glue in there? Into that corner. See, I, that don't even look bad. You know. And, uh, man, it really stiffened it up. And, uh, there I ain't got no primer on the bottom. <laughs> Forgot to prime it. But, uh, it's nice. Came out really good. Hard to believe all this stuff was in a bucket yesterday. There's some primer in a can over there. There was some epoxy in that can and some cloth from that roll over there. Look at it now. It's got to spend its life as a canopy. For 105 Thunder Chief, baby. It's missing something, though. It's missing something there, a sharp pencil. <laughs> so. Oh, Paul has our canopy plug. I have that plug. I gave it to Paul last time he's here. He's got a buddy with a vacuum former machine. All he's got to do is take that plug over there. Take it over. <laughs> oh, but I've just been kind of cruising today, man. I got my thousand videos made. How you all doing on my two million views? Huh? I'm going back and watching some uh reruns of bob tv get caught up on some of the videos you missed while you're waiting for me to click make a new video and and show them sponsors a little love <laughs> check this out this is my gear door bam look at that bad boy it is just now see this is here on this edge this is one layer or two layers of that four ounce cloth. That's just uh, a little bit stiffer than a sheet of paper. You know, about as thick, a little bit stiffer. You know, and then you take that, and this piece here is for this aileron servo cover, right there, but this is that two layers of. Uh, four ounce that foam and then another layer of four ounce and man it's just unbelievable what that does you know sure like it but anyway I got my gear door already cut out over here and uh, we're gonna put it in place over there hold on a minute talk amongst yourselves a little bit while I cut this out won't take me but a minute See. to uh, do that with that lift edge or with that foam on the bottom I'll just cut it back about a quarter inch now I'll sand that and uh, 
put me some resin on that edge prime that I want to paint it all you know that'll look that'll be my inner gear door but look this is two layers of carbon man <laughs> just don't budge an inch it's got this one's got a layer of four ounce cloth a layer of the five ounce carbon a layer of that foam and a layer of uh, five ounce carbon but I wish I would have put some of that four ounce on top of that it would have came out a little smoother I'm going to have to prime them up a little bit to get them smooth but that's alright I'll use my primer and a squeegee <coughs> show you what I'm talking about that's really all I did today but man look at that fit look at that bam that's just perfect just perfect don't even stick up man that's flush fit man that's perfect everywhere put a little pressure on it right there and this is everywhere that's not that's not nice gear door I've ever seen right there but uh now I just mess with you guys I had that cut out already <laughs> sitting here cruising man I got cruising on a couple videos tomorrow and I got my thousand just like y'all wanted see how good I am to you guys I want to see how I cut this up we won a thousand videos by New Year's Okay, I'm on it. <laughs> okay, one more thing. Let me get the Bobo glasses. This stuff really cuts pretty easy. Man, but you still fog my glasses up.